for the longest time I've been fishing with a fishing crate, a custom one, that I kind of zip tied and screwed on rod holders. But the past 30 days and prior, I've been losing rods. But we're not here to talk about rods, we're here to talk about the Black Pack Pro. I measured the width of the black, the back portion of my SS-127 Bonafide. And it looks like it's definitely long enough to fit at least one battery box and a 16 by 16 Black Pack Pro. Now, so I ended up buying the Black Pack Pro, which is 170 something dollars on Amazon. I believe it's well worth it. And I have, I've been looking at other IGers, Instagrammers, of how they set up their Black Pack Pro. So if you look up hashtag Black Pack Pro, you'll see like different ideas of how people put together their batteries and their Black Pack Pro. We're gonna go and check out what to expect when you receive your Black Pack Pro. I got mine off of Amazon. I'll show you all the links below. Ugh. Here it is, guys. This is what you get in the mailbox. Black Pack Pro. And this is what I'm going to be setting up on my kayak. Bam. It comes with two, three, four, five, six, six rod holders. Bam. That's. That's basically all you'll need. And this is what this is what it looks like. Right there. Pretty sleek design. You get one nice yak attack sticker. So we got the 16 by 16 rod pack right there. All right, it gives you step by step instructions. Tools needed: handheld Phillips head screwdriver, and that's all you need. Cool how they laid out the instructions. And then you get one, four sides. You get your made in the USA top. So this is gonna be the lid, I believe. And then this will be the bottom right here. I don't know about you guys, but I'm not so thrilled into building things. You know what, I'm gonna brave it out. I'm gonna try to put this together. We'll see what happens. I'll see you guys back maybe in an hour or two. So what do I think overall? I just love this Black Pack Pro. It's exactly what I was looking for because what I was coming from was a simple crate that video production people use in the background for grip equipment or a grocery market would use for produce. And I stuck maybe three Three of those rod holders, you'll probably see it on Amazon. I'll probably put it up in the screen somewhere, but there's three rod holders combined together. So I bought three of those, which equals to nine. And I kind of just jerry-rigged it all around this crate. And it was pretty sorry. The good thing about the Yak Attack Black Pack Pro is that they have thicker walls so that way when you drill into it, those screws don't poke in and reduce the amount of storage that you put inside the crate itself. So I got the 16 by 16 because you could put so many 3700s or 3600 cases in here. I have my terminal in here, my jigs, my chatter baits, my jerk baits, my crank baits, my top water, you name it. I could put everything in there, most of it. And uh, I'm also thinking about putting my 50 amp in there, 50 amp hour Z Pro lithium battery, so that way I could keep everything to a minimum in terms of Pelican cases. And so, besides the storage, what I did notice when I put this thing together, this thing is sturdy, super sturdy. It's not flimsy at all. Um, it's made out of plastic, hard plastic, but build quality and the design of it. They, you could tell that they put so many hours and so many days, so many weeks, so many months in the R&D to de develop something that's way better than, you know, your do-it-yourself crate at home. 
the design is just simply complete. Lastly, please like the video. It helps this video grow the channel. All it takes is one click. Subscribe. If you guys have any questions about my other products that, that I use, and for instance, my live scope, my nine inch Garmin unit, or you know, for instance, my, my camera as well, and my lighting, feel free to put that in the comment section if you have any questions. And I'll be sure if it's popular enough to make that content for you guys. Anyways, I'm out. Peace.